Oatmeal is a standard breakfast item here in our house, and we love our baked oatmeal. I can share that recipe right here, but we also love an upgraded version of oatmeal that we call caramel apple oatmeal. So today I wanna to share that recipe with you. There is nothing better than a warm, delicious breakfast on a cool fall day. And this caramel apple oatmeal recipe is going to be a favorite for you and your family. First, we're going to peel, core, and chop up two large apples. Now let's move over to the stovetop where we are going to get a few things going all at the same time. You're going to need a pot for your oatmeal, a cast iron for sauteing up your apples, and another pot for making your homemade caramel sauce, which is amazing, by the way. Let's get our water into our oatmeal pot and get that boiling. Next, let's add two tablespoons of butter to our cast iron and get those apples sauteed up until they are nice and caramelized. We are also going to get our homemade caramel sauce going. Combine your pure maple syrup and heavy cream into the pot, along with a dash of salt. The caramel sauce takes a little bit of time, so make sure you have at least 20 minutes to let this reduce and thicken. Also, keep your eye on that caramel because it likes to bubble over. Once our oatmeal water is boiling, go ahead and add your organic oats and let them cook up until you have the texture and consistency that you like with your oatmeal. Once your apples are done, set them aside. Once your oatmeal is done, set that aside and give all of your attention to that beautiful homemade caramel. 
This is definitely not going to be a thick caramel, but one that can be drizzled easily on top of your oatmeal. You are going to want to let it reduce by at least half. Once your caramel is done, you can prepare breakfast for your family. Be careful though, you are going to want to eat this caramel all by itself, but you can do it. It's really better on top of the oatmeal. Enjoy. caramel sauce makes it. It's so good.